Welcome to Take 5, your five-minute inspirational message from Solid Rock Drogheda. We are continuing in our journey through the book of Proverbs. Every day this week, we're looking at a wonderful little proverb that we can apply in our lives. And Proverbs chapter 4 and verse 38 says, The path of the righteous is like the morning sun, shining ever brighter until the full light of day. A friend of mine used to say that he, years ago as a child, he, this guy was older than me, but he said as a, a child, so we're going back a long time ago, probably going back into the 1940s, 1950s. And he said that he saw on the back once of an old gypsy caravan, one of these one beautifully painted and decorated, he saw a sign that said this, life with Jesus gets gooder and gooder. Well, I might not agree with the grammar, but I agree with the sentiment. Isaiah chapter 9 and verse 7 in one of the passages that we use so often in our Christmas carol services said, says of Jesus, of the increase of his government, there shall be no end. You know, in this world, things don't get better. Things tend to get worse in the natural order of things. There is a scientific principle, one of the laws of thermodynamics called entropy. And entropy basically means that disorder and randomness increase with the passage of time. So, for example, you build a new building and it looks great and it looks nice and everything in its place. But you know what? You leave it alone. You don't maintain it and it begins to crumble. It begins to deteriorate. It begins, mold appears, starts breaking through the facades and it doesn't look nearly as good. A beautiful garden, you plant a beautiful garden, but leave it to itself, it ends up like a jungle. Or think of some of these abandoned cities. There have been cities where people used to live and because of some great catastrophe, they then become deserted. There's a Varosha in Cyprus that uh, basically is on that line between northern and southern Cyprus, the Greek and the Turkish zones. And so what was once a city, a bustling city, a tourist attraction, is now just deserted uh, in, uh, in the Ukraine. Uh, near Ch the Chernobyl disaster, there's the city of Pripyat that was built for the workers in the Chernobyl uh, nuclear power plant. And now because of the radioactivity, it is deserted. And uh, I tell you, these are I've seen um, film f footage of both Varosha and Pripyat, the photographs of them. And it truly is eerie. You've got, uh, you can see what used to be a real living city just gradually being overtaken by decay. You, you see weeds coming up through the paving stones, coming up through the road. You see things rusting and, and falling apart and roofs falling in and windows getting smashed by, by strong winds and gales. And it's, it's entropy. It's, uh, in the words of the Nigerian author, uh, Chinwe Achebe, it is uh, things fall apart. Now, that's true of the world, but it's not true of the kingdom of God. The kingdom of God, things don't fall apart, but life with Jesus does get gooder and gooder. You know, we talk about things as if entropy, the falling apart, the decay, is part and parcel of everything and is inevitable. I hear people talking about marriage that way. They say at first it's great and then the honeymoon is over and it all goes downhill. And I've even heard people talk about their Christian faith that way. I remember I was sat in a meeting once and somebody says, do you remember when you first received Jesus, how excited you were? And I thought, well, I was excited, but I'm more excited now. My excitement hasn't diminished. It's grown because entropy might hold true in the natural world. But in the kingdom of God, it's not entropy, but of the increase of his government, there shall be no end. You see, God created order out of disorder. From the, from the, the beginning of the book of Genesis until the next few verses, things didn't go downhill. They got better because God created order out of chaos. Um, and this verse, Proverbs chapter 4, verse 18, the path of the righteous is like the morning sun shining ever brighter until the full light of day. That's saying that when you 
are walking in God's favor and God's blessing and God's grace. Because our righteousness is not what we do, but it's who we know. It's our relationship with Jesus. Then it's like the morning sun shining ever brighter until the full light of day. So our Christianity should get better and better. The move of God in the church should get better and better. Don't look back to the good old days of revivals of past, but look forward to the better things that God has in store for the church. And yes, in marriage as well, in a Christian marriage, and I'm speaking as a man now who has been married for 37 years, but in marriage as well, I would say to you, don't be afraid. It doesn't get worse. The honeymoon can be great, but what follows is going to be even better. I pray that will be your experience today in every area of your life. If you're married, I pray it's true in your marriage, but I pray it is true in your Christian walk in Jesus' name. Be blessed today and may life get gooder and gooder and join us again tomorrow for another Take 5, your five-minute inspirational message from Solid Rock Drogheda.